Okay, folks, Bob here. This is one of the cars I came to look at, and it's already sold. He says the guy was here at 8 a.m., and uh, I didn't leave the house at 8.30, so the early bird gets the worm, but this is a 69 Roadrunner, and it's got a ton of parts. <clears throat> Excuse me, got a ton of parts that it went with the car. So uh, I won't be getting this one. That's okay. Sixty-nine Plymouth Road. It comes with a 440 engine. It's, it was born with a three, obviously a 383 HP Magna motor, but uh, that motor's long gone. So it comes with a 440. It came rather with a 440 out of a C body, but it needs this. It comes with a had floor pans and trunk pans all all with it. It needs uh, quarter patches. They did not come with the car. It comes with a trunk lid, as you can see. But uh, yeah, this would have been a. Uh, a very ambitious project for me, but it is a 69 Roadrunner. I mean, these, these cars are finally starting to come on. For years, these things were bargains. Couldn't believe that, how cheap some of them were going for. But uh, yeah, we didn't make, we didn't get this one, but we're here to look at another one. So, uh, without further ado, yeah, they have a little rock back here. I think they make, AMD makes patch panels for all of that, so. Give me something to practice on my welding, but that ain't gonna happen. The other car I'm here to look at is in much better shape than this one, so uh, man, uh, these cars here are you know, Roadrunners were, were kind of uh, no frills, they had a lot of that good power to weight and a good price. That was the, the deal with the Roadrunner, they didn't have a lot of fancy stuff, a lot of heavy stuff, anything, any trim or. Most of them didn't even have uh, bench, uh, had bucket seats, a bench seat column shift. But uh, gonna make somebody a nice little project if they can weld. <laughs> All right, folks. Well, we're not. We didn't get this one, but uh, let me see if we can put a, put something together with the other one. Now I'll be back with you.